Hello. Happy Halloween. Boo. It's me. Kind of. I thought I'd throw my makeup on and Jaxie's in the bathtub. Say happy Halloween, buddy. Happy Halloween, everybody. I hate Halloween. It's depressing. Because it means it's going to be over. And i got to put everything away for a year. Blah. No fun. But, you know, hey, I got my makeup on at least. <laughs> ah! So, I thought I would show everybody something. <laughs> Spooky. We were in the paper. We were in the paper. That's our, <gasps> that's our house in the bottom for decorations. So, you've seen online, like I've, I've put. What's up, buddy? What? What? Baby's in the bathtub. What's up, buddy? Ah, okay. What's up? So I got gloves, the skeleton, or not skeleton, but uh, spider webs, and my shirt that I'm wearing, and another Halloween shirt. This is more of a traditional mommy shirt, I'm assuming, but um, I love the haunted house on there with the kids, so I got that for like. 10 bucks at Kmart. I've been picking up all kinds of pieces here and there. So, doing all kinds of that stuff. A um, couple of interesting stories, I suppose. Uh, I did a video a while ago that was, that I talked about my Annabelle experience where Annabelle was at the Haunted Museum the same time I was talking to, um, no, I wasn't talking to. Ryan Buell was live telling his Annabelle story and she was at the Honey Museum. Now, I don't know, I, it's so hard to say, like, you watch it and you want it to be so real and you want to be all excited about it and have it be really crazy and spooky and I just, I don't know, like half of me can see how it can be staged and the other half is like, you know, that's really cool. I uh, found out too, or I went back and I looked at my pictures of Vegas, and there's um, the El Cortez has a 14th floor room, and um, on that room, or in that, if you look out the window of the room, the Haunted Museum is like, I mean, El Cortez Haunted Museum is like straight out your window. And um, I love that room. And supposedly, El Cortez is a ghost on the 14th floor. So the only thing I've ever happened was the window. We were standing there looking out the window, like right by the elevator. And the window itself popped open. But I mean, that could have been anything. It could have been somebody had moved it. Who knows? Although it didn't move. I mean, I didn't find it open just the one time it opened while I was looking at it. So I don't know. It was weird. Yeah, you'll hear Budgie get in his bath. Stuck him in the tub so I can kind of keep an eye on him. And... What are you gonna be, buddy, for Halloween? Um, I'm not sure. He's gonna be Frank. He's gonna be a butler. I, I really should like go get his tray and show you guys his tray. His tray is awesome. Come on, come with me. Let's let's go. Ignore the mess, please. What's up, buddy? Halloween balloon. Hello, Halloween balloon. Okay, ready? That's just the treat bucket, but... Jax, Ryan, made Jax a treat bucket with eyeballs and fingers and things. So he's going to hold it out. He's going to hold it. When he took her treats and, and then they dropped the candy into the hole and I'm gonna bring the other bucket for the bigger stuff. So that'll be fun. Yeah, my completely dirty messy house.
But hey, you know, that's okay. I'm always, I'm, I'm lazy. Oh, it's nice out, apparently. Yesterday it was all snow. It had snowed. And now it's like not snowy. So, yeah, that was fun. But um, the Haunted Museum is open. Um, they showed last week, they had, Saturday, they had the uh, Ghost Adventures that had Annabelle in it. And uh, they had, what else did they do? They had Father Sebastian and Bloody Mary, and everybody that I said was going to be there was there, plus a couple of other white witch, dark witch type things. I hope this is staying. These don't stay very well. So. Yeah, I wish I could have been there. It would have been interesting to go. I don't know, someday. Someday I'll make it. I'm hoping to get back to Vegas for the 13th wedding anniversary. I hope. We'll see. But I hope everybody's having a good Halloween. I'm always depressed this time of year. It's always hard for me. I just, you know, it means winter and I like Christmas and stuff, but I just, I love Halloween. I love today. Today is my day. So hopefully tomorrow we get some good things on sale and, um, oh, I forgot to show you my arms. And uh, I'm probably not going to wear this shirt. I'm probably going to try and find like a, a doll shirt or some kind of something that's That'll make me look like a haunted doll. I don't know. We'll see. But there's lots to do. Um, I have to go pick up everything out of my yard because it all blew over again. So, yeah. That's going to be fun. Get my child out of the tub, I suppose. Anyway, I hope you guys all have a spooky day and, um, you know... Stay out of trouble. Eat a lot of candy or don't eat too much candy. Whatever you like to do. I, I had so much to say and now I'm like drawing a blank. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. Um. Yeah. I hate these awkward moments between the two of us. Don't you? I don't know why I'm even doing this anymore. It's it's hard. It's hard in the beginning to like make videos and stuff when nobody watches them. So, but that's okay. That's cool. I can rant and rave to nobody. You know, I talk about my ghost stories that no one wants to hear. Yeah, it's definitely a depression day. So. I want to be in Vegas. I want to go back to the Haunted Museum. Or I want to go to the Haunted Museum. I want to go back to Vegas. Um, I don't know. I'm going to stop rambling, I guess. But, um, happy Halloween, everybody. See you tomorrow. Bye. Say bye, Jax. Bye, Jax. <laughs> Say happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. <laughs> Bye.